Hi, it's Lee from ColoringQueen.net and I want to show you Etheria, which is not actually a colouring book, it's loose pages. So I'll show you how it's packaged so that you can see what it looks like for shipping. It's in a lovely little plastic sleeve. This is protected by a little insert that goes around it and keeps the whole package really sturdy. And then inside you have this lovely card cover. So it has this little outer on it, a plastic sleeve that you can slide up. And the lovely card cover with beautiful coloured artwork on it. Inside it's wrapped in tissue paper and it has a lovely little sticker on there sticking it down. This is very tightly wrapped as well, just to protect the loose pages during the shipping process. I, of course, have already opened it and uh, had to pop it back together again. And this is quite a thick paper, not the sort of very fine tissue paper. And then inside, we've got our lovely 18 coloured pages. So these are printed on heavy paper and we've got that picture from the cover. The line art is black, it's fine, very textured and very detailed. And it's not a bright black, it's a dull black. On the reverse of each image, there's a lovely illustration and the number of the page so this is one page out of 18 and on the back here there's different colors being used on the line art so this is like more of a green and then that's more of a brown and some blacks there as well with that lovely border around it it's very thick paper lovely and suitable for watercolors and of course for framing, they're A4 sized roughly. So the illustrations are extremely detailed on in this set of pages. So one piece is going to take a little time to finish. Now this is a self-printed uh, book, so the artist has gone out and found a printer to print her artwork and attended to all the packaging and the shipping and everything else that goes together with putting out some line art for people to colour in. So it's not available on Amazon or Book Depository or any of those places only from the artist's site herself. And on the back, you know, there's a lovely little work of art on each one because every picture is different. A gorgeous carousel horse there.
That one's a little bit creepy. This one looks a little bit Christmassy. Now normally I'm not keen when the artwork is cut off, like here, but this is sort of made for framing the beautiful paper and the loose pages. These would look fantastically good framed, and when that's in a frame, it'll look really, really good. Normally you think 18 pictures is not very much for a colouring book, especially one that's a little bit pricey, but the paper is excellent and the artwork is extremely detailed, which in my view makes it worth the price. It's sort of a luxury item. This is gorgeous. And there we have the thumbnail, Tales of Flowers. You couldn't really uh, colour those, they're just so small, those little thumbnail images. But you could, of course, test your mediums. And that's it for Etheria, a stunningly gorgeous set of colouring pages. Until next time, happy colouring.